Hello everybody and welcome to a quick from the depths tutorial on how to delete your blueprint folders. Now the reason why it's so hard to delete the blueprint folders is that when you quit out of a game it saves to the cloud but when you restart the game it looks to the cloud and compares your files and any that are missing that were that are on the cloud that aren't on your computer it re-downloads onto your computer and that could be one of the reasons why it takes a little bit for from the depths to start but this means that anything that you tried to delete while not in the game won't stick what you need to do is first open up the game let it load let it get into the title screen and then what you're going to do is you're going to tab out or hit your little Windows icon if you're on a Mac. I'm not sure what it is because I use PC. <laughs> I'm sorry. But just get to your computer's desktop. And then from there on Windows, it is stored. And again, on Mac, I'm not sure. So you're going to have to look for it. But on Windows, it will be in this PC's documents going into the From the Depths folder player profiles, your your profile, whatever you named your profile, and then into your constructibles. Now from there, you can then delete whatever you want in terms of the folders, because you can delete the blueprints in game, but you can't delete the folders, I don't know why. But from there you can delete the folders, then close, close, once you delete did everything go back into from the depths and close that out now that should reflect the save that when it saves to back up to steam if you have it on steam it will see what is different between your computer and the cloud library and it will make the changes to mirror your computer but only while the game is closing so now that you those files are those folders are deleted it will go oh these folders need to be gone and we'll delete those folders so once that is done and everything is closed out the next time you load your game those folders will be gone so i hope this was helpful thank you guys for watching it you if it was helpful please do leave a like as it does help this video and the channel and do subscribe to catch more tutorials. I'm going to do one on maps next in the future. So, and walking through how all of the tools work and stuff to my understanding. Because it is a learning process. But, also check out the description below to see how you can help support the channel. So that I can make these a little quicker and more effectively. And... I will catch you guys in the next tutorial. Thank you for watching, and have a good one. Goodbye.